at eight o'clock, we got Michigan State who's three and zero, traveling to Boston College who's two and one. Boston College favorite by six and a half points on the ACC network, and one of the more underrated and underappreciated games of the late window. A game that I think is going to be actually really interesting. Aiden Chillis has gone forty six to eighty one, thrown for six hundred fifty yards, four touchdowns, four interceptions. K. Ron Lynch Adams had thirty four carries for two hundred ten yards and a touchdown, and Nick Marsh has had eleven catches for two hundred thirty two yards and a touchdown. Thomas Castellanos has gone 35 of 54, thrown for 589 yards, nine touchdowns, two interceptions. Trishon Wards had 26 carries for 153 yards and a touchdown. And Lewis Bonds had 10 catches for 156 yards and a touchdown. Boston College is 4 1 against Michigan State all time. Last game did go to Boston College in 2007. Their Michigan State is 0 2 at Boston College, but they're 1 and 1 in one possession football games. Um, this is an interesting team game for both teams because this is the kind of prove it game, right? Um, Boston College is coming off a sad loss against a really good Missouri team on the road in a game that you actually competed in pretty well. And honestly, Boston College really impressed me with that loss. I think I think obviously you're a French top twenty five team. If you lose, you're going to get dropped out of the top twenty five. But I do think this is still one of the twenty five best teams in the nation. I still think this is one of the better ACC teams in the nation. I think this is a chance to prove it. Are they stand for Michigan State? This is your chance to prove that your 3-0 start isn't just because of who you played, right? And honestly, the FAU game was bad. That was a really bad game. But two weeks ago, you beat a really solid Maryland squad on the road, I believe. Um, and then you beat a nobody last week, right? This is your chance. This is your chance to really prove something, have some momentum, heading into a big game against Ohio State next weekend, right? That's your chance to really, really prove it, right? Maybe you pull off the upset there, that, that'd be a massive shocker. You'd shock the world, and you'd suddenly definitely be put in the top 25. But this is a good chance. Like, if you you move to 4-0, and I think you're going to make a name for yourself if you're Michigan State. you're going you, They might move into the top 25 simply because they would want that game against Ohio State to be a high-profile football game. But I think this is a big game for Michigan State to kind of prove themselves. Uh, this is the Boston College 9-11 game. They don't lose that one very often. So that would be worrying if I was Michigan State. Uh... It's a solid Boston College team. I think this is a Boston College team that absolutely can compete for an ACC championship this year. I think that everyone looks at the top three and assumes those are the teams that are going to be competing for an ACC championship. But Boston College absolutely has a good enough team to be competing for that ACC championship. I think BC could absolutely be a surprise team, a team that makes a surprise run. Bill O'Brien really has those boys playing, and Thomas Castellanos is a really talented young quarterback. Um, same with Aiden Chillis, but I think Castellanos has more reps under his belt. I think he's a better quarterback. I think Bill O'Brien knows how to bounce back from a loss. He's done it many, many times in his coaching career. Uh, Bill O'Brien might just be a college coach because he's done a hell of a job at Boston College so far. Give me Boston College to win and cover and pull off the, and win and cover at home. 